Okay, so there has been this article uh, circulating uh, social media talking about Social Economic Status, SESS. Social Economic Status, SES, is an economic and sociological combined total measure of a person's work experience and of an individual's or family's economic and social position in relation to others based on income, education and occupation. Indirectly at this point of time, most of us actually fit under low SES status. When I, when I saw this for the first time, I thought like it is... I mean, to a certain extent, stereotypical, biased almost. It's actually a bit racist because in all honesty, right? This of Singlish, sports like soccer, ETA Hawker Centre, people that live a higher social economic status, i.g. the Chinese. It's a form of like, Accidental racism. This kind of stereotype is something that shouldn't define whether you know you're a better person or not. It doesn't. It doesn't make right. you a better person. Right. I do feel that people need to know the different activities people take part in. People want to be high ses, whether or not they are born in high ses. They just put it on a pedestal. So automatically, if you dress well, if you speak well, you are valued more by society. And I don't think that should be the case. I feel like that is highly encouraged, you know, for a lower sales person to step out of the comfort zone and talk to more people. Actually, both ways, so that you can just understand the world better and not just live in your own bubble. You cannot go in complaining or oh, why these high sales people get more opportunities at a higher value than us. Yeah. When you just want to stay the same, you know, you have yeah. to diversify. Just because you have more privileges that money can get you doesn't make you any more, doesn't make life's challenges any more easier for you. This kind of education right, shouldn't shouldn't even be um, put in institutionalised education systems. Why is there a clear definition of the black and the white? Because I'm 50 shades of grey. Oh, <laughs> not in that sense. Hi, mum. There's so many variables, you know, there's so many factors. You cannot define someone just like this. We came into this world with nothing. We're gonna leave this world with nothing. The fact that you are teaching people that, oh, certain people are from different caste systems. Right, then, then we are like much no better than certain countries that has a caste system, right? Rather have no money than have debts and worries at the end of the day. We're gonna accept whatever it is in the situation with, with like society right now, but at the same time, we also need to respect people as people individually. I think that's the most important. Just be a normal human being, huh? Don't teach people about this kind of bullshit. Huh? The only sass I know is sassy sass, bitches. Okay, alright, I'm done. Use travelling overseas during school holidays every year for leisure. What bullshit, your mother paid for you, right?